You need to plan a nice picnic yeah. with your significant other, maybe a group of friends. And one gal can take care of the whole set and the food. Lucky Lori Waltz is in Sacramento <laughs> checking things out. Did a little picnicking. Picnicking. Yes. Hey there. Good morning, you guys. Okay, this is so great because Alicia, who you're about to meet, didn't even have an Instagram account before COVID. She was working in insurance, doing her thing, COVID hit. And then voila, a passion project came to be. And she started this Instagram. That's how I found her. And now you're doing this awesome business, charcuteries, picnics, all in one. Alicia, this is a ton of fun. Yes, it's amazing. Like you said, it's a passion project for me that just kind of transpired into something more than I could have even imagined. It's amazing. The uh, picnics that I've started to do is something new. Charcuterie was something that I started first and I'm self-taught. I don't have any background in culinary. So it's just amazing to see the followers um, that I have and the people that are interested in my business. It's just uh, such a blessing. Yeah, and you started with grazing boxes. That's I how this did. all started. Yes, so I started um, Mother's Day actually was my first uh, grazing box that I did. And then referrals, people just started to post them and talk about them. And then I just got to do something bigger. And it's amazing. It's something, like I said, I love to do. Um, and I'm getting paid to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Even better. Even better. Like shopping and, and all this is just right up my alley. So this is amazing, especially being a boy mom, like we were talking about. <laughs> yeah, and I, she has three sons, I so do. she gets to get a little girly on the side here. I do. So, um, yeah, exactly. Doing these picnics is new for me, but it's getting bigger and I just can't imagine where it's going to go from here. Yeah, and I love that you were doing insurance, you were doing a desk job, and then now you're just completely outside the box with this new business. I am, and it's just me, so I take everything, I set it all up for you, I do the whole setup, the whole cleanup, um, I have different themes, anything that you could think of, I have all the colors, um, and just... Love and life. Love and Just life. love and life. <laughs> so here's what's cool. I mentioned she didn't have an Instagram account. Now the business really has become Instagram based. That's where you're finding a lot of your customers. It's amazing how Instagram is such a big platform for all these small businesses. Like you, I don't have a website yet, which is something that I want to get, but Instagram is my sole base of how I get business. Yeah, and what has been the best thing about this so far for you? I know you're loving the shopping, and I'm sure you're meeting a lot of great people, but to really take, take a huge career path change. Yeah, so my goal with this is to, to grow, get bigger, um, eventually maybe have some people employed with me. That's where I would like to go. Um, and just... Well, guess what? If, if these guys can't find me, I'm working with Fresh by Her. <laughs> that's where you'll find me. I'll be over here doing picnics and charcuterie <laughs> because that sounds like a lot of fun. And what's cool, you guys, you can pick, you know, whatever location, locally, of course, um, and she'll come set this all up, take it all away for you. She does all the work and it makes it look real nice in the process. Yeah, guys, I'll send gorgeous. it back to you. We'll link everything to GoodDaySacramento.com. But, of course, Instagram, like she said, has been her spot to get all her clients back over you. Can I just say that I'm jealous that she didn't have Instagram until this whole <laughs> <laughs> man. And she's using it for such a good she's reason. Using it, for good. it has I such a purpose. It. Love it. Yes. Not yeah, the exactly. Dumb way I use it. Yes. Thank you, Lori. <laughs> Thanks, Lori. Same. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>